Welcome to this three minute episode that'll provide helpful scan building background info. Before building a scan, it is important to know that we have two different types top list windows and alert windows. CTRN Sir yes. Bill VWO and KJNCE Ben. Let's look at the similarities first. Both will scan the market according to your filters. You can define the price range, shares traded, the RSI, the ATR the distance from WeWAP, the short float, and hundreds of other criteria, to find exactly the stocks you're looking for. All filters work as ANDs. This means that the scans will only output stocks that meet all of your filters, not just some of them. In the summary tab you can see an overview of the filters in use. In this scan, a stock needs to be between $1 and $1,000, and have traded at least 50,000 shares already today, and have had a volume in the last 5 minutes of at least 300% of normal, and is up or down from the close at least 2%. Now let's look at the differences. The two types of scans handle the results they find, differently. Top list windows rank the found stocks, and keep this ranking of your favorite stocks constantly updated. Alert windows, on the other hand, check for an action. The latest action of your favorite filtered stocks is always displayed at the top, together with a timestamp. Let's head back to the top list window. You can define the ranking in this sort tab here. If you'd select shares traded, the stocks that meet all your filters will be ranked from top to bottom based on how many shares they have traded. Now, let me show you how this changes when we choose price instead. And voila, now we have all our favorite stocks ranked by price. Again, all these ranked stocks are your favorites, because they meet all your filters at the same time. Alert windows, as said, monitor the stocks that meet your filters for specific actions. They only display a stock, once it has made a distinct move. We have hundreds of different action alerts, to choose from. The most popular ones are new highs and lows, pullbacks, channel breakouts, moving average crossovers, opening range breakdowns, and unusual volume spikes, just to name a few. If you choose a new high as the action, you will be notified at the exact moment a stock meets all your filters, and, makes a new high. One last thing. In contrast to filters, alerts work as ORs, so you can easily monitor your favorite stocks for multiple actions. As soon as the stock makes one of these moves, your alert window will trigger. Okay, enough theory, let's put all this into practice. Head straight to the next two episodes, and build your very own top list and alert windows.